Here you go. Thanks. Come on, let's play. <laughs> so here he is in person, James, the star of the Action Movie Kids series. Let's see it, buddy. So I was at Toys R Us with James. Yeah. We were at Star Wars Isle, and he asked if he could play with a lightsaber. Mm -hmm. And at the time, I had already started adding effects to his videos, and I thought, oh, this will be perfect. I'll just film it. And so I filmed myself grabbing the uh, lightsaber, handing it down to him. And he did this amazing lightsaber extend and hit the shelf, and then turns to the camera and just goes, oops. It was beautiful. I couldn't have planned it better. I couldn't have coached him into it, but he was just hilarious in his performance. And so there was something so amazingly genuine about it that it, I think it, I think it's the reason why it's still the most popular video on the channel. Well, that's true, and that is actually why we hooked up with you because we, we are a campaign idea. It was the perfect complement to what you do. There was something really wonderful about it because I felt like I'd always loved Toys R Us as a kid, of mm -hmm. course. Um, and when I did those videos, I remember thinking, man, something like this would be really, really fun to do as an ad campaign or something like mm -hmm. that. I had a, it was a fleeting thought, and it was months before that. Um, but as soon as the web series went popular and all of that came to fruition, it just it, it felt really amazing. So I was overjoyed as soon as I heard. It really was a dream. I was doing ridiculous videos with my child in a Toys R Us playing with toys. And here comes the escape pod saying, we love that you play with toys and do crazy things with children. Why don't we do more of them? Here's money, here's planning, here are resources. And the way they approached these particular ads was really just enabling me to do this hyper version of things that I wanted to do. I mean, it was a giant uh, group of over 20 commercials, I think, um, came together extremely quickly. Uh, with a lot of people moving in the same direction, and I think it's really neat when you get that kind of chemistry going. I've got to say, I'm really happy with the way the 30-second spot came out, too, by the way. I was really excited about this spot because it was the first time we were working with adult actors, or in exclusively adult actors, for a spot, which was neat. It also had a little bit of a story. In this case, we got to really bring the whole story to life. Every time I watch it, I always find something new to, to laugh at. My favorite being the fact that the giant Lego man is wearing a Christmas sweater. I don't know why. That gets me every time. <laughs> Was there any reaction from your Action Movie Kid fan base to the Toys R Us spots? The reaction from my fan base was really funny. It, it came in a couple steps. The very first was, have you seen the Toys R Us ads? They're ripping off your style. My goodness, <laughs> call them up. To which I got to, to tweet to my fans, Toys R Us engaged me for all of that stuff. Mm. I directed those commercials, and as a response to that, I got overwhelmingly positive reaction of people excited to see that my dream was kind of coming to life, and people really couldn't imagine a better fit. Well, thank you very much, Hashi, for taking the time out of your busy day. Wonderful, yeah. It's a pleasure to work with you guys again, and we'll have to do something again sometime soon. Go blow up something else. Mm.